Here we have the striped mask that sits over the top of an image. When you click on this link, it will give you the effect and then link out to the page that you want to link to. In this instance, we've set it up to go to uh, meet the team because that might be what you want it to be. It might be linked to our services or something like that. Uh, I'm just going to click on it. You'll see I've linked it out to dividend.com and that's what happens. Uh, so I'm just going to go back and then that shows you the effect. It's uh, quite a cool effect uh, and let's show you how to update that. So let's go to the mermaid bundle test page. Uh, first of all, you can go to the image and then scroll down, find the big image over here. Make sure that it's full screen image and try and crunch the image so that it's not too massive for mobile devices or things like that. Let's go to advanced, see if there's anything to change there. I don't think there's much to change. So let's close that out. Then there's the masked image itself. That you don't need to adjust any of these. And also we've got the borders here, border one, two, three, four. Uh, we've said do not remove them because it's needed for the mask effect. So that's self-explanatory. If you want to have more masks on the same page, then you're just going to duplicate the entire row itself or the section module. In this case, there you can duplicate the row to get the effect that you want. Then there's a link over there, meet the team. So I'm going to open that. It's labeled out. Uh, meet the team. Obviously, you can change it to what you want. You can change the link out here to internal page. And then there's also the design element that we might want to change. There's the button text color. Again, we'll change it to green. And then we probably want to switch to advanced here. See if there's anything in there. Um, let's have a quick look. No, that's it. Okay, and there's the hover color as well. So we probably want to change that. That was under design here. Uh, let's change it to a darker green color on hover and uh, let's do a quick preview there we go and save and exit update let's do a reload there we go so that's all updated and then the effect with the redirect we all set so that's how you update this mask thanks for watching